what is up YouTube? So we are going to do a week of me vlogging. It's kind of an interesting week. I bounce around here and there. So I wanted to kind of show you guys around and show you what it's all about. And today I'm on general nuclear medicine. So let's start the day. I said I'm on my general nuclear medicine rotation this week. I did switched around, moved around a few times to cover some residents who are on vacation, so I'll be at other spots later this week. So, so far this morning I've just read a few studies. It's a little slow in the morning of general nuclear medicine because a lot of the stuff takes time for the radio tracers to go into the body or the specific organ we are targeting. So we have to wait a little bit in the morning. So I've done three lymphocentigraphies. So for lymphocentigraphies, we basically inject technetium in the skin surrounding a melanoma. And after we inject, we wait about 15, 20 minutes, maybe up to an hour, and wait for that radio tracer to travel to the closest lymph node, which we would call the sentinel lymph node. What we do is we mark it under our cameras, and then the patient will go up to the OR, have the melanoma, a wide excision of the melanoma, and then they will try to find the lymph node that we marked and take that one out as well to make sure there's no metastasis. So I've done three of those this morning. I will read a few more scans coming up here shortly. And I'm just trying to tie up some loose ends before I go to the conference. I'll check back in afterwards. Ah, the sun feels so good on the face. I'm officially done. It is about 4 p.m. We get to head home early today because we finished all of the scans. And I'm gonna go home and work out because I was too lazy to do it this morning because for some reason I was tired from having a weekend off, which makes no sense. But I'm gonna go work out, cook something for dinner, and do this all over again tomorrow. We're on a different rotation tomorrow, so stay tuned to find out which one. All right, it is day two. It is Tuesday. And today I got pulled to ultrasound. Yeah, so I don't know why I got pulled to ultrasound today, but I did. So probably just sit in there read some ultrasounds, and hopefully get out early, maybe? I need to film another YouTube video, so I should probably get home early, right? Anyways, cue ultrasound montage, now. I've been here just crushing ultrasounds and today I've been feeling a little under the weather so I've been like here I'll show you I've been like crushing these all day today and then I'll show you what else I've been I picked these up when I was in Amsterdam for I got sick when I was on Croatia for vacation and I have no idea what it says but I think they're cough drops so if anybody knows what this says, let me know. But I'm pretty sure it's just cough drops with some vitamin C in it. So this is what I have been doing all day, is crushing ultrasounds and having Dutch cough drops. So if anybody speaks Dutch, tell me what that means. Oh, and P.S. I usually try to avoid taking medicines that I can't read the name of, but I had someone help me at the pharmacy in the airport. She spoke a little bit of English, and I think those are actually cough drops, so. That's the only reason I'm still eating them today. You can tell by my voice, it's a little on the sore side today. So hopefully I get better because I haven't told you guys yet, but I'm going somewhere this weekend and it's gonna be fun. Now it's time to get back to work. So I'm officially going home right now. And normally I would go home and work out, especially since it's like a beautiful day out, I would probably go running. But since I feel kind of crappy today, I think I'm just gonna go home Hang out, rest. Ambulance is a little loud, sorry. So I'll probably just go home, rest, and I have to do my haircut today for my big trip coming up, which you still don't know where I'm going. But yeah, 
that's pretty much it. Hope you guys don't mind this kind of like random vlog that I'm doing, but I just wanted to show you guys kind of loosely like how a week is in the life of a radiology resident. So hopefully you guys find it somewhat interesting. And if you do, I'll keep doing it. So head home now. All right, so I just finished having a nice dinner real quick and now I'm going to get my haircut. And yes, I'm still in scrubs and haven't changed because sometimes when I get my hair cut, I don't like all of the like haircut shavings in my shirt. And before you guys say, yeah, but any good hair salon will put like something around your neck and make sure nothing goes into your shirt or whatever. It doesn't matter what they put on, there's still hair that gets down in your shirt. So sometimes I just keep my scrubs on so I can just throw them in the wash when I'm done. All right, so let's get a haircut. And as you can see, I got the new haircut. It is time to go to bed and I will catch in with you guys tomorrow. I'll be back on nuclear medicine. And good morning. It is Wednesday. Terrible weather out here as you can see, which made it super difficult to get out of bed. But I did. Had two good night's sleeps in a row, which is pretty impressive for me. And I feel pretty good. So off to work. Alright, so I know I haven't really talked to you guys much today, but I was basically just hammering away pet scans all morning. Then I went to a little peds conference in the afternoon. And then hammered away at more pets in the afternoon after that. And that's pretty much it. So it's a pretty low-key day for me today. And right now I'm gonna go head home. And that's pretty much it. So yeah, I pretty much have to go home and finish making another video, which you guys will see shortly. And I think I should probably start packing, make dinner, and get everything ready for my trip this weekend, and try to get all my videos squared away. And that's about it. So I'll check in with you guys shortly. And good morning. It is 6.30 a.m. and we are here for Grand Rounds on a bright and early Thursday morning. So I'm gonna grab my white coat, which I pretty much never wear, but I have to for Grand Rounds. And for those of you who don't have a good white coat, Figs actually sent me this one, and it is. I mean, I'm not even joking, it's like amazing. Again, I don't ever wear these things, but it has this inner lining, if you guys can see. And you can like pull your sleeves up and stuff, it's super comfy. So, if you're in the market for a new white coat, hit up Figs. Much better. And good morning, it is Friday. I apologize for not vlogging the last day or so, and that sun is super bright. Let's go back over here. So I'm headed to the airport today. I'm on pet this morning, then I'm headed to the airport later this afternoon, and we are going to be heading out, which is why I'm dressed pretty casually today, as you can see. And uh, yeah, I'll keep you posted. We're just gonna read a few pets, eat some lunch, and then take it over to the airport. And we are on our first stop in Atlanta. So stay tuned to figure out where we're going next. destination. Maybe you guys can kind of guess at this point by what is in the airport. We can't guess. I'm in the great state of Nevada. Las Vegas, Nevada, that is. And I'm going to see my brother and best friend at the hotel. I'm trying to rush meet them for dinner right now. 
and I'll give you the update of why the heck I'm even here. All right, so I just made it to the Hotel Caesars Palace. I'm going to meet up with my brother and best friend. We're going to grab a bite to eat in a second. And I'll show you the room right now. Hold on. I've never been to the Caesars Palace before. Here we go. Hello. <laughs> Somehow we're still going strong. I don't even know what time it is, but I've gotten like no sleep in 20 hours. But for some reason the city just <laughs> makes you stay up. I don't know how. And good morning. It is day two of being in Vegas. It is like 8 a.m. And as you can see, the place literally never stops. People will sit here and gamble all night into the wee hours of the morning. I got a few hours of sleep last night and I'm a little tired. I feel like I've done like a night call shift or something. And because I went to bed at like, I don't know, two or something and got up at seven. Plus it's all this jet lag, it's all screwing me up. But time to play some more table games. But first, coffee. All right, now I feel a lot better. Got my nice venti cold brew coffee with the bro and friend. Yeah. And we're just roaming around the casino aimlessly until we go to the buffet. This is what it looks like fresh in the morning. <laughs> Nothing like a Saturday morning in the fall in Vegas. Yeah, that's time to go. And here we go. Our home for the next few days. made it back home after a long trip all the way from Las Vegas. So I didn't really tell you guys why I even went to Las Vegas, but I'll get into that shortly or once I get home or something or when I edit this video. But I'm going home now. My is about to be here. And yeah, that concludes this week. All right guys, so I am officially back at work after a long weekend in Vegas. And I want to show you some. This is an old view box I'm sitting in front of. So I can kind of like adjust the lighting. This is old school. Anyways, so is that lighting good? All right, cool. All right, so anyways, I am back from Vegas. It was a very long week. I didn't even tell you guys why I even went to Vegas. And that was because my brother and best friend actually had two different conferences there at the exact same time. So, which means they had hotel rooms that they were staying at and they kind of just stayed in one for the weekend and they said if I flew out there I had a place to stay so I did I haven't been to Vegas in like five or seven years or something it was my third time there it's been a while had a ton of fun gambled a little bit hung out with my brother and friend went to some really nice dinners and had a good time so now I'm back at work I got in last night at about I think I got at midnight got home around 12 30 or one and went straight to work this morning and i'm pretty tired so hopefully you guys enjoyed this week in my life as a radiology resident if you have any comments leave them below as always make sure you smash that like and subscribe button follow me on instagram if you don't already otherwise i'll see you guys on the next video